morning, Captain Whitaker. Here's your manifest with 102 souls on board. Let's get them tucked in. We're ready to push. Hello everyone, I'm Rachel Mullins. Now you know that nervous feeling that you get when you're about to take off on a plane? Well, once you've seen this film, you are never going to want to get on that plane again because let me tell you, they have quite a serious crash. Starring Denzel Washington, we're here on the red carpet ready for the premiere of Flight. So you're here for um, Flight? Yes, and Flight. Get, um, Oscar nominated for, for Denzel? Yeah, well I think he should win. Yeah, it's great. Good. Yeah. Yes. Um, Oh, it's a, uh, it's, it's, you know, it's a very harrowing story, a story of a man who's, uh, who's got a lot, make a lot of changes in his life, and uh, it's got everything you might want, you know, drama, action, comedy, suspense. How does it feel to be working in um, live action again? Oh, I love it. It's live action. It's great. How is it like working with Denzel? He's magnificent. You know, he's just always, always a joy to work with. You never know, uh, you never know what you're going to get, but it's always perfect. You what know? have you got coming up next? Don't know yet. You know, I'm one of those guys who always takes a break in between films, look around, see what I want to do. Now, you know? I've been researching. You've won 21 awards. And oh, really? That many? Congrats, Phil. Oh, well, there you go. Where have you put them all? Oh, uh, <laughs> yeah, I've got them. Uh, yeah, I've got a, a case in my office. They're all there. Yeah, it's Thank great. you all very much. Have to move Thank, you. Thank you, everybody. Thanks, Sanzo. Can I ask a really quick question? Yeah. What's yeah. the, the, big, the uh, biggest budget in the world? Do you think that can sometimes count to improve creativity? What's that? Oh, yeah, no, no, no. This is the only responsible way to make the film, absolutely. Yeah. But one thing about so that it's kind of about the moment in this guy's life that totally turns it around for him and he's changed by it. Is there a moment in your life that inspires you to kind of well, work you know, around that scene? You know what Bob Gil D Dylan said, if we're not busy being reborn, we're busy dying. So we, all, we always have those life-changing moments coming at us. Rebirth, rebirth, rebirth. Rebirth, rebirth, rebirth. Thanks, Denzel. I've just got one very quick question. Yes. Um, it's your first live action film since uh, Castaway in 2000. What's so special about Flight for you? Well, I love the screenplay. You know, the screenplay was so special, so unique. Uh, I loved it so much when I read it that I had to do it. Excellent. <laughs> you hope to meet him? I would love to meet him. I was just saying over there that I was hoping to get a hug. Oh, that would be good. I bet he'd give a great hug. I think it would make my January. <laughs> I mean, I've always thought about it, so... This cold night to get a Denzel Washington hug. A Denzel love hug. I'd love that. Mm. Right, this film yes. is about a plane that kind of basically dies. And, and Denzel brings it back. Which Denzel would. Do you get nervous when you're about to take off? I'm not so bad on takeoff. It's when we're like mid flight and there's a bit of turbulence and the plane starts. It's when it drops. You know when it drops in your stomach? That's when I start freaking out a little bit. It's like this roller coaster rise when you go yeah, crashed yeah, yeah. on the, the river flume thing. Exactly. So you're going to maybe get a bit nervous when you see it crash tonight? I think because I, I do get quite scared flying, so this is probably not going to help. <laughs> Just. Oh no, but you'll enjoy the film anyway. I can't wait. Denzel Washington is one of my favourite actors, so I'm very excited. And he's, he's nominated for Best Actor in this, right? Absolutely. So, you know, I think he's going to be... Well done him. Right, this film, so it's about flying and basically the plane crashes. Would you be scared about plane crashes? I'm actually not. I, they don't bother me. Like I just think if the big bird comes down, reality is we'll probably die. So you won't bother with the whole the crash embrace thing that you've got to do? No, I think that you're dead, basically. So, But I, as far as I'm... This film, he saves everyone. So, And there was the Hudson River crash as well, which was amazing because everyone survived. Um, so no, it's never really been a fear of mine until today. That's good. Ollie, say, Ollie says it's a, it's a big fear. So you sit next to him and you hold his hand. He reacts badly to stuff like that as well. Aww. He'll be screaming and <laughs> shouting. <laughs> oh, I love it. That's a cute image. Uh, yeah, we'll be hugging each other at some point. Oh, lovely. Well, even if Denzel doesn't give you that hug, you've got Mr. Proudlock. And he, he gives good hugs as well. Speaking from I bet. Oh, I want one now. <laughs> Ultimately, do you think he can be at peace with himself? The balance? Uh... I don't, I don't know. I, I, I hope so, but you know, he, 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 he's responsible for the loss of life, so he's got to live with that. But is he responsible for the saving life? Maybe the other ten pilots that, that didn't do it, maybe he saved and, lives. Yeah, I mean, yeah, I'm sure he, he, he would say that to himself, but yeah. you know, he would have saved all the lives had he not been on the plane the drinking. Yeah. 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 Right. So, Denzel, in a way, your character has killed some people. How, why do people buy into your character? Uh, why do people buy into it? I, I don't know. Why would we like you as a... <laughs> That's a question you got to ask yourself. That's a, you know. Do you think you're a good man in it? 
I don't worry about that kind of stuff. I just try to play the part and, you know, let the chips fall where they may. Cool. But you enjoyed it? Yeah. And, oh, absolutely. Michelle Obama recently said that you are her celebrity crush and she also said that she wants me to pick her up. Now, how do you feel about that? That yeah, beats a sharp stick in the eye, doesn't it? That's, that's beautiful. That's, that's lovely. But you've been married 29 years, Denzel. Yeah, yeah. Well, I'm not going anywhere. It's the longest marriage in Hollywood. No, it's not. How did your wife react when she found out that you were going to play such a shocking part? Does she have any say in your role? Uh, I didn't tell her. <laughs> like making the movie? Oh, it was enjoyable, you know, working with Bob Zemeckis, great director, you know, excellent script, great actors to work with. What was the most challenging part? Uh, I don't know. Um, I don't know. It's, I mean, it's all, I mean, I enjoy it. I don't, I don't look at it as a challenge, I guess. I, guess uh, I can't say one thing in particular. What did you most enjoy about the movie? Uh, seeing it. <laughs> Actually, seeing the finished film because it was, you know, you 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 do you're doing your part when you when you're doing your part, and then when I saw the actual crash sequence, you know, you, we didn't have all of that. We were just like sitting there going like this, but uh, you know, Bob Zemeckis put together a great film. Tonight, then, what do you know about the film? Are you excited for it? Well, I love Denzel. Um, I think he seems like a really traditional guy, like longest marriage in Hollywood, 29 years. To his like that? Yeah, I'm quite impressed by that. Um, and I know he's going to be some kind of hero saving people, which I think really suits him. So I'm a fan of his work, so I'm looking forward to it. Are you excited about the film? I am. I know nothing about it, apart from the obvious. Uh, the title sort of gives a little bit away. But, uh, yeah, I'm very much looking forward to it. Super excited that Denzel's obviously been nominated for an Academy Award um, for Best Actor. So, you know, fingers crossed when the big night comes, he'll, he'll skip that. So. I'm sure he will. I mean, he's going to put bums on seats, isn't he, with this film? Absolutely. Massive fan of his work. And, yeah, just looking forward to getting in there myself and, and seeing what it's like. The origins of the film are that uh, it was an original screenplay written by John Gatons, who is our screenwriter, and he's nominated for an Academy Award, as you know. He had been working on the screenplay for nine years, and he wanted to direct it for a period of time, uh, but couldn't get it together for one reason or another. He gave it to Denzel, and Denzel really liked the material a lot, but I think Denzel was looking for a more experienced director. When when John decided not to direct it, the script was given to us. We had done Real Steel that John wrote, and he gave us the script. We fell in love with the script. We thought it was terrific. Bob called Denzel and said, gee, I understand you're interested in flight. Denzel said, yeah, I really am. I'd love to do it. Denzel asked Bob, Bob, you want to direct it? Bob said in a second, and that started the and whole we off and running. We were off and running at that point. Steve, can I quickly ask you, what drew you to this script? Pardon me? What drew you? Yeah, what drew you? To this script? It was just special. The, the, well, the script was so compelling, and the character was just so well written, and such a morally ambiguous character, one that wasn't black and white. It was a really, it, it begged a lot of question. And when you read it, you just really wanted to know what he was going to do and couldn't stop reading the screenplay. And you never really knew because he, he was out of control. You didn't know how, what was going to happen. So. I mean, he's sort of a character where, you know, he's not not perfect and no one can be so no one's kind of fully good or fully bad it's is it more He's a very I don't know, we can get it more character, yeah and you know searching you know and he thought that he uh, he didn't think he had a problem he thought he was living his life you know but he was in big trouble and uh, so no different than any of us yeah. <laughs> sounds brilliant congratulations thank you thank you, thank you. Thank you. Well, I hope you enjoyed us chatting to all the stars and celebrity fans of flight you've been watching the fan carpet Trying to save your life. My life. We're gonna stop power. Brace for impact. No one could have landed that plane like I did.